The last time you were on, December 7th, you said that you would like to bring 10,000 jobs back to the United States. Is that going to happen? Are, are you underway? Have you ramped up your hiring? The industry is prepared to bring that kind of uh, uh, quantity of jobs to the market. For every single job that the, U that the steel industry creates, you associate another seven solidly paying jobs in that value chain, and it all happens inside of our country. We have already started deploying. We have an operation uh, at Rennes City that we're beginning to start uh, rolling back in, in February. And we have another one in um, our mining operations that uh, are going to come back in Minnesota come March. So we've begun to address that. Very quickly, if there was a single, I may have asked you this the last time, if there was a single regulation that you would like to see rolled back or amended for your company and your business, what would it be and why? Well, we have several regulations that address permitting for the investment in, in new processes, better processes that can generate better products going forward. And in some cases, in order to get the proper approvals, it is taking more than two years. And I think that's a significant, uh, it's significantly detrimental to Who's our ability it? to continue. Who's delaying it? What, what agency? It's the EPA for the most part. I believe you said the last time that one of the rules pertain to water that you take out as part of your process and that you're required to put water back into the system that is not just as clean but cleaner than what you took out. Am I remembering that correctly? Well, uh, you're directionally correct, Tyler. What we have is mo most of the water that gets treated and re-put into the environment, it fulfills all of the requirements so that nature is never damaged. Right. What we're seeing is that the requirements is that they're going beyond by far what, what nature would uh, be able to receive back without any negative impact to it. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.